Hey it's Unders, today's Logic Pro tutorial we're going to show you how to make a really quick and easy white noise riser and downer. Let's get into that. Say my name aloud. Hi guys, we are now in Logic and in this video we're going to simply go over how to create a white noise riser rather than a pitched riser. So this is generally used for uh, intro build ups and transitions during tracks. If these videos are helpful for you, please pop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you've got any questions or comments, please leave them down below. So let's get into this. We're going to create an instance of alchemy. We are going to give this some information here, and we're just going to create a very simple one note four bar loop. And it's not hugely important. We'll go with that right there. If we bring Alchemy back up, we are going to default it. We do that by going File and Clear. We're going to click on Advanced over here on the left just to get us into what we need here. Now, if we go into Oscillator A, we can choose the Advanced option of A on the left hand side. We are going to choose white noise on the mode here and we're going to turn the oscillator off you'll see over here on the left it changes to noise and then over here it's white so we've now got pretty harsh white noise that's all right now we can use this cut here and it gives us quite a good effect however i prefer to have a little bit of a control when i do a white noise sweep and introduce some peaks into it so if we go into global and filter we've got a resonant option here and we can alternate that together with the calf and these give us uh, some really nice variances in the sound so in my typical fashion i'm just going to go to touch automation and just grab all of these for like a real quick way to link them up So now we should have some information for each of those, like so. So first off with the cutoff, I would generally start quite low and then just bring it right the way through like so. So we've now got this. And with the resonance, I tend to have that relatively high throughout the start and then slowly take that out a little bit quicker as we go through. So we get something along these sorts of lines. I do that because the resonance peak in the higher frequencies tends to become a bit harsh. For example, if I were to put it up like this. Right, it gives that great effect. I find it a bit harsh and I prefer to sort of roll it off depending on what you're doing and what you want to achieve. But Find that more pleasing and then you can sometimes play around with the drive and get quite a nice effect if you just bring that up right towards the ends just adds a bit of flair to it and lastly i quite like to just add a bit of reverb onto white noise we should get classic reverb and we we'll drop the mix right the way down and then we get something like this And there it is, and built from scratch, white noise build up. Really easy to do, really simple in Alchemy. You can use some of the other plugins available in Logic, but I find Alchemy is the best because you can do everything you want in house with the plugin. Hope the video was helpful for you guys. I shall catch you on the next video. See you soon.